Namaskara. Especially for students who have taken chemistry as a subject in this academic year. Myself, Uma Shankar, working as an assistant professor in the Department of Chemistry, KSOIO. So in our department, we are offering three courses, PhD, MSc in Chemistry, as well as BSc in Chemistry. So in the academic year 2022-23, whoever joining a chemistry, MSc, course we already created a whatsapp group so that if you have any doubts you can post your doubts in the chemistry whatsapp group so the theory classes also been started and the timetable is also loaded so in the university as already announced the ia marks uh, ia questions of this academic year is as same as the last time what we are posting for a July session. So many people have already in their assignments. So whoever not yet sent, please send your assignment before 15th of this month so that we can evaluate and upload your IMRs in time. It will be useful for you also and it will be good for a department also. And whoever not able to attend the classes directly or on time, you can record the classes on your mobile. And whenever you have got a free time, you can watch later. So in the that option also given to the students. So mainly the MSc courses we are running in CBCS mode. So, which consists of four semesters. In the first year, you are studying first and second semester. In this, each semester contains three hard core, is called SCT, and one soft core is SCT. So, hard core and soft core both have 100 marks theory papers. Uh, in that, 80 is written exam and 20 is I a question. So in the 80 marks question, the previously question papers are uploaded in the website. So you can refer the pattern of question paper and the kind of question will be it in the exam. So if you have any doubts regarding any topics, you can post your doubts into the WhatsApp group. So any of the faculty, we have a seven faculty and all their contact numbers are there in the departmental website. So we will definitely clear your doubts or you can post as a group discussion also. So many people can respond to your doubts so that you can have a better answer in that way. So previous students also following the this method so i think this is the best method so that we don't know what kind of answer many people they have so if you have a different types of answer you can choose the better one which you like that is the one of the advantages in the whatsapp group we have in the art core we have to uh, four credits in the soft core is a three credit paper and along with these four paper you have practicals in that 50 marks two papers each so we have not compulsorily made attendance for a theory classes but it is compulsory to attend the practical classes so the practical classes table will be uploaded as soon as the theory class is over the theory class are presently running so the practical will be conducted 12 days from morning 9 to evening 6 so from morning session it is a paper 1 and in the afternoon session is a paper 2 so after the 12 days of completion of the classes we immediately conduct a practical exam so whoever have attendance of minimum 10 days they are eligible to take a practical exam otherwise 
we are not according to UGC regulations. Those who have less than 10 days attendance are not eligible for taking a practical exam. So be sure you have to compulsorily attend practical classes. That is the mandatory science program. So after the theory and practical classes over, the university will announce the uh, not notify the examination and announce the date of examination timetable everything and you can select your examination center nearby center while you paying the examination fee for presently we are conducting a practical at Mysore center only but our vice chancellor instructed this time we have to conduct the practical at least three or four centers all over Karnataka. So we are planning this time to conduct the practical classes in Ballari, Mangalore, Bangalore as well as in Davangere. So when and where we will announce soon. So this is for a MSc students. For a BSc students this is a three year course and for a first to fourth semester we have a chemistry as a one of the paper in which there are three blocks and practical is one more paper so it is a hundred number theory in that 80 numbers for a examination and 20 for a IA and along with 50 marks for a practical paper for BSc also we are not forcing the people to attend on time the theory classes because we know we are many people are in working classes and they are not they may not attend the classes on time so we have provided the option of recording our classes and later on you can watch those programs but according to UGC rules and regulations practical classes are compulsory so we will conduct a six days practical class for a BSc students or BSc course so in out of six five days attendance is compulsory so presently we are in the process of making a whatsapp group for a BSc students is not yet completed once the group creation is over we will upload first the theory classes timetable and we will conduct first theory through online after the theory class over we will conduct practical classes and we will inform the timetable and examination of the practical classes soon for BSc people also we have to submit your IA questions to the department the address is chairman department of chemistry Karnataka State Open University Mysore so please send all your assignment to this address for MSc people we have to write four paper assignment so many people have a doubt so we have to put a four different covers and put that is not necessary we have to write four papers differently and put into the one cover and send it and whoever taking chemistry as a open elective subject please send your assignment open elective course assignment to the chairman department of chemistry don't put your assignment to your uh, regular cover and send all them in one to your respective department because the evaluation of assignments will taking a long time so in it will not reach to the department in time so you may lose IMR that's why you will send your regular subject IA papers to the respective departments and send separately the open elective papers to the department of chemistry and for a practical classes I already mentioned it will be conducted in case for your center and for theory exams it will be conducted in respective districts so whichever is near and whichever is suitable for you we can opt for a center for theory classes but for practical classes 
we are not yet finalized the centers once we finalize the center we will inform to the students so for msc peoples out of the four papers three are hard core and one is soft core so in the first and second semester three uh, hard core and one soft core is compulsory so the students have no choice but in the second year means in the third and fourth semester you have two hard core and two the uh, one practical Mean means there are three hard core paper and you have a choice of soft core in that we put four soft core paper in out of four student can choose any two soft core therefore in the third semester we have a three hard core including practical and two soft core so in this soft core we made a subject in such a way that the spectrochemistry and other ne necessary topics we put in the hard core paper and regular inorganic physical and organic chemistry we put it in the soft core so you can choose the same specialized subject in fourth semester also so for example if student can choose inorganic and organic as a soft core in third semester they can choose the same subject in the fourth semester also so that you become a specialist in one general subject so if you choose first inorganic and organic in third semester and analytical and physical chemistry in fourth semester you may lose the continuity of the subject that's why our intention is to prepare a student to a thorough knowledge in any one of the stream in chemistry in that view we are make a syllabus in such a way that student can opt of its own choice and interest so that he will become a master in any one subject of the chemistry so in addition to the soft core choice we have another one choice in the fourth semester that is dissertation so many people who are working in industry as well as in the research oriented institutes they can opt a dissertation as a one of the paper in four semester so whoever opting dissertation as a one of the subject they can choose only one soft core instead of two so that they have a choice of doing a dissertation so whoever not able to access the research laboratory to do their dissertation course so they can opt two theory paper in, in such as two soft core so we have many choices of student student orient oriented program in chemistry so whoever having their uh, reasonable and their interested they can choose as a, a, according to that courses so this is about the chemistry courses and if any doubts we have a seven faculty in the department and all their contact numbers are given in the departmental website and can contact through phone or post your doubts through whatsapp group so if you want to contact a teacher directly please contact in the office hours because in the uh, after the office hours teachers may engage in their own uh, other works so they may not able to pick up your call so try to contact teachers in the office hours and we are ready to solve your problems and do whatever your needs for regarding chemistry subject thank you one and all